when I got here, um, I sort of had the sense that I wasn't sure if I belonged here or not. And uh, one of the very first people I met was a woman who was very organized, had her plan all set up, and she was going to double major in physics and music. And she was a, at the time, it wasn't called the Intel Science Competition, it was still the Westinghouse Competition, and she was one of the finalists in it. And, you know, this was within 24 hours of arriving on campus. She was showing me page by page through her report that had made her a finalist. And, I just, I really remember thinking, I don't belong here. I shouldn't be here. Like I was an admissions mistake. Somehow my file got through. And uh, the first quarter I was actually at Stanford, I got the worst grades of the whole time I was at Stanford in the first quarter I was here. And, you know, I thought I was a pretty good student when I was in high school. When I first came into the English class, I thought, and I didn't think I was the greatest writer in the world, but I thought I was a reasonable writer. And I think the first paper I got back, I got a C minus on, and that was a little bit of an eye opener. Um, and the two things I took away from that, the first one was a sense of feeling as though I couldn't do it or I'd done something wrong or I was in an environment now that was different than the environments I was in before. And I remember the thing that I eventually got from it, and it took me a while to realize this, was that she wanted people to really learn. She wanted people to come in not thinking that they already knew everything and that, oh, this is just going to be another one of those classes like you're probably used to in high school if you ended up as a Stanford student here where things were relatively easy and you probably got a lot of A's, that if that's always the case, you're not taking away a real learning experience. You're not realizing the things that you don't know. And there were a lot of things about writing that I didn't know. And by the end of the class, you know, little by little things kind of improved. But what it really made me realize was that I needed to take a step back and take a look at what was I getting out of this? Was I just getting out of it a letter on a piece of paper? Or was I really getting out of it an opportunity to learn? And why was I here, right? If the point of being here was to get a bunch of little letters on a piece of paper and not to actually learn something, that's not really doing a service to the fact that you're at a place like Stanford. And so what I really appreciated about it was the fact that the class actually made me a better writer. Yeah, it was challenging. Yeah, I probably didn't get the grades I wanted to get. But when I came out of it, I thought I've actually learned something. I've gotten some experience out of this, which was a result of having to take a critical look at myself after getting this less than stellar grade. Um, and it wasn't the greatest feeling, right? I think that was the first grade I actually got on anything at Stanford, right? And so when you show up here and you're not sure whether or not you belong here and you get a C-, that's kind of reinforcement of it.